What's up guys? Will H Tech Review back with another video. Samsung DeX on the Samsung Galaxy Tab S7 Plus. That's the topic for today. I want to talk about using this natively on the display as well as using it wirelessly. Uh, Samsung DeX is my favorite part about this device. Uh, using this device, uh, you can use it in tablet mode and you can also use it in Samsung DeX mode. I like using it with the 12.4 inch Super AMOLED display. Gives me this great feel of a laptop, especially when you hook it up with a wireless Bluetooth keyboard. Now you don't have to have the official Samsung keyboard. This is just a little inexpensive keyboard. I think I paid $16 for it. You can find these at Amazon. You can find these uh, at Best Buy, Walmart, all over the place. You can find little keyboards like this. I also have it hooked up with the Microsoft Arch mouse. Uh, I picked this up from Best Buy. I think it was like 30 some bucks. And this is not Bluetooth. This goes through a little hub right here that I have plugged into the dongle, plugged into my Type-C port. And this little Spider-Man looking deal, this is just a thumb drive, flash drive that I have plugged in that has some uh, files on it. So here's Samsung DeX. Uh, this is, gives you this desktop environment. If I right click, I can change the wallpaper, stream zoom. These apps that I have here, I, I place them there. You can place these wherever you want, just like on a PC or a Mac. You come down to your far left. This puts you into all of the apps that you have on your device, and you can all drag and drop these to your main screen. Over here, I can exit Dex, go to Dex Labs, and things of that nature. Uh, the next tab over shows me all of the apps that are running in the background. I can close them out. I can jump into them one by one. Uh, I can do... Uh, things like that over here this brings up your keyboard now you got this little floating keyboard you can also change this to uh, different style keyboards you can go to your standard layout just like so you can go to a uh, uh, split string keyboard like this this is if you're not using a uh, Bluetooth keyboard like I am if you're just using it by hand uh, you can also take a screenshot right here. This tells me I have 28 notifications that I can jump into and I can interact with. Uh, this is my quick toggles where I can turn on Wi-Fi, turn off Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, uh, dark mode, you know, just like you have on your phone, your phones. So let's demonstrate a little bit on DeX here. What I like about DeX, you can have multiple windows open at the same time. So... If I want it, uh, let's go to, I'm going to go ahead and open up YouTube. I can have YouTube open there. I can have Facebook open right here. And I also can have Twitter open over there. Now, all of these windows, I can move around. I can, I can also have more if I want. But uh, if you start putting more, you, you're going to have, you know, you're going to run out of space quickly. But you can swap between each one of them. You can resize these windows like so. You can, if this is too small, I can always uh, snap it into full screen like so. I can also snap it to one side like that and have another snap over here if I wanted to. Uh, so let's go ahead and snap. So there it is. I got those two snaps side by side. If I didn't want that, uh, let's see. Let's go back. I want to go ahead and open those windows back up again. So Facebook, I mean, uh, uh, YouTube is over there. And we're going to get, what else did I have open? Oh, Facebook. So we're going to go ahead and Put that back in the middle. So this is Twitter. Let me get Facebook open as well. So here it is. We're going to drop that back in the middle. And as you can see, you can just move these around just like you want, any kind of way you want. And 
This is the beauty of Dex. So say for instance, I want to be watching a, a video over here as well. So I'm going to go to my channel and I'm going to pick out one of my videos. So I'm going to pick this one here. And of course, I'm going to get an ad first. Skip that ad. And this is my video right here. So you can all, now you got a video going and you can come over and you can still stroll your social media and do whatever you need to do. Interact, uh, if you need to respond to comments or whatever you need to do, this is the beauty of Dex. This is one thing I like about Dex and you can be very, very uh, productive on this. So another thing I like about Dex Say if I open up Google Docs here and I want to create a new doc, new document. All right, so I got a new doc going there and I, I need some information to put in here. So I'm going to go ahead and open up Samsung. Uh, matter of fact, I'm going to go ahead and snap these two. So now let's snap this one. So now, now you can do this in tablet mode as well, but I want to go ahead and I want to go to uh, Best Buy site and I want to find some information about, say, the Samsung Galaxy Tab S7. So I'm going to come over here and I'm going to uh, select this text right here. I'm going to go ahead and copy it. So now when I come back over here, I right click and I can paste all of that information over here. So uh, that is one excellent way that you can get stuff done uh, with Dex. So that, that is how I use Dex. Uh, I edit videos on here using an uh, app called uh, Direct Power Director and it works well. And I also, you know, this is, this is great. The screen size on this is great for video editing. So here's a video I did recently. And I'm gonna go ahead and say edit that. So now this is the size screen I get for editing my videos. So there it is there. So let's see how this, and this works well. No, you're scrubbing through the video. You don't have any issues with this at all. It just works well and you close it out. So now let's look at this using it wirelessly and I got a big 55 inch TV right over here that I'm going to be shooting this to wirelessly. So if I wanted to use this uh, wirelessly, I'm going to go over here to my settings. And once you're in settings, you want to go to Samsung Dex right here and come down to where it says connect wirelessly. So now you click, click that button and it's going to tell me that it sees my uh, Samsung uh, sees my 55 inch TCL Roku TV. So I'm going to go ahead and start now to connect to my TV. And my TV now is, ask, is asking me to allow it. So let me reposition my camera to get the TV. Okay, guys, uh, reposition the camera as you can see on my TV. It's asking me to allow uh, my device to connect. So I'm going to go ahead and allow it. Uh, starting video from Will. So there's the Samsung logo, as you guys can see. And we should be in the DeX, as it says. So this is Samsung DeX on the 55 inch TV. And there's my mouse. So as you can see, I'm, use, I'm use, moving the mouse, no latency. Uh, let's go ahead and open up something here. So let's go ahead and open up YouTube again, see how it works. So there's YouTube. Uh, what I like to try this. No, I don't want to try that right now. So let me go ahead and click out of that. And let's go ahead and play my video again. So this is what you get, man. You get big candles like this. 
for Samsung DeX. And I think your sound's gonna come through your TV set or whatever sound equipment you have hooked up. It's definitely gonna come through there. So check that out, Wheel H on the big 55 inch display. I'm gonna go ahead and make that full screen. And I'm gonna pop, uh, snap this into full screen. So there's Wheel H. Now this is a 4K display as well. And I'm running my video, I recorded that at 1080. So that is beautiful. This is Samsung DeX. So let me go ahead and minimize this like so. If I wanted to open up Facebook again, as you guys see, no latency. I can also still resize these. So Samsung DeX is great, man. Let me go ahead and resize this. No latency, man. Doing this real time. Strolling through Facebook. So this is sweet. I love this about Samsung uh, devices. And you can do this with your Note, Samsung Note devices as well. Uh, the Note 20. You got the wireless on there. So this is uh, Twitter here. So check this out, guys. Even if you got bad eyes, eyesight, <laughs> you can't miss this. So. And the sound is coming from my, my TV set, so I'm going to go ahead and snap that back. So, yeah, that's sweet, man. So, if I wanted to, I'm going to go ahead and close this out. So, if I wanted to... Uh, do some uh, like the documents I was working on earlier Then you got a big old display here that you can use for that and you guys can see all of the docs that I've worked on in the past uh, just all kinds of stuff man uh, that I got here this is a strip I wrote up about the iPad 12.9 after two months uh, yeah so uh, you got a lot of cameras now. If I wanted to use this, like I said, I like to use it for video editing. Look at the monstrous size of this display that I have to work on my on my display, man. Uh, on my video here, this is this is crazy, man. So let's see if I can stroll through. Yeah, strubbing, no issues. No issues at all. If I wanted to add uh, add an overlay here, this is Power Director, by the way. So if I wanted to add this little dude here, let's see. And there it is. So I put two of them. I don't know why. So if I want to edit to edit this, add some words. Now I'm using my Bluetooth keyboard keyboard keyboard, guys. Let me go ahead and get this. All right. you guys here uh, the keystrokes are right on time so no latency I wanted to add some color to this I can do that and I always like to do this so there it is and I can move this around wherever I want yeah so Samsung DeX works great wirelessly coming from the Samsung Galaxy Tab S7 Plus. All right, guys. So this has been just a little video about Samsung uh, DeX on the Samsung Galaxy Tab S7 Plus. If you guys want to see something different from what I did, leave a comment down in the, in the comment section. Or I'll try to make another video uh, letting you see some other things that you want to see. Will H Tech Review. I'm out.